frequencies in use in Dalo this evening. I've taken quite a few photographs. Um, quite some interesting patterns. As you can see, they're quite deep. what appears to be a trail on the diagonal there although I wouldn't know the sun has brought me through on occasion in that direction there's been a lot more frequencies than this like I say I've taken tons of photographs on this uh, video actually that I can actually see but the main ones at this time are those obviously somebody's pressing the bloody buttons aren't they somebody knows what they're doing there's some appearing over this way now started with. Oops, that's a window. And as I've said on videos that have maybe never ever been published as yet, these frequencies will obviously be going through us, won't they? Whatever frequencies they're using will be uh, absorbing them too so I know how a Debbie gets ill with them sometimes I only say that by trial and error because uh, when she's feeling off colour she asks if there's any frequencies and it usually turns out that there are when it's um, particular kind of fatigue that she catches. I don't really exactly advertise it. Over there there's two drop downs. Or two or more. Sorry about the shit flies. I can't look at it. What about those? Fruit flies actually. Got these before and um, took some photographs and um, ended up with that sort of wave effect. like a lot of waves it's quite nifty actually now whatever the motive for these well your guess is as good as mine nice bit of orange over there I hope this is catching it Good test for the camera. I tried it on nighttime landscape and I just can't get the focus. So I'm trying it on automatic. It's a Nikon L340 or something like that, I think. Good little camera generally. It picks up better on nighttime shots than the Sony Brick and the Canon. So it's not a bad little camera in some respects, you know. Steadiness, that's a problem I've got, I'm afraid. I can't do a lot about that. They're getting pretty intense. The waves are mean. Over that side up to the north. some way of triangulating where these are coming from. I'm going to have to sit down actually. Sorry about this. 
very painful for me. Right. So easy, where are we? Up, up and flat. There we are. I'll just see how it goes along. There's two diagonals. Like chem trails, probably are laid or marked out by planes. I don't know, but the lines seem to be either side of them. The frequencies, I mean. together over there now, over the clock tower. Um, capture these. I apologise if my voice isn't too clear or loud. I'm full of a bloody cold. It's not exactly helping things. Plus I don't speak English, I speak Lancastrian, so there you have it. Bloody flies, because they have to be in every show, don't they? I'm kidding. Now those two uh, dark lines are showing up a bit better now. They certainly do look like they've been left by planes at some point. sky appearing over that way. I think the sun's already gone past that area now. I think it's more over towards the hotel. But we're well overcast. Very well overcast. There you go, we do get a shot of those. Point now the frequencies. The others that were to the side of Cuthbert's. That's about all that's left of them that I can see. Now, I can't quite guess looking at those where they're coming from I'd say behind the church now on the other side of the church from where we are there's a lot of those um, cell dishes whatever you want to call them cell towers on top of um, a British telecom building a lot of them now whether or not they're using those two Use the send out the frequencies. I don't know, but it is definitely a possibility. And they all seem to be. They do look like they're coming from that area behind the church. In fact, most of the weather patterns generally seem to look like they're coming from behind the church. I'll just go over a little bit. Stand again. 
out. See for yourselves. If you have a look at the clouds in general, I've taken many a picture and a few videos and things seem to be coming from the church. The cloud patterns and formations. They all fan out from the church. Now that is where the cell towers are. I can't get a picture of them because of the big tree in front of the church. You can actually see it in autumn when, or winter when there's no leaves on the trees. But they've, they've added to it. There's about three cell towers on top of uh, one building. And they're well cluttered up with um, transmitters, receivers, transceivers, whatever you want to call them. But keeping that on centre a second, obviously the two planes are pointing in that direction, but the what I can tell of the frequencies they seem to look like they're coming from that area too. You see what I mean? Follow the planes. Everything goes back to the church. It sounds familiar, that doesn't it? it all the conspiracies and Stuff, church behind everything, control. But in this case, I'd say the cell towers behind the church. Anyway, I'll take some more pictures as I go along. Uh, camera and lighting permitted, of course, permitting. And have a nice evening. <laughs>